Hello friends. It was a special day in Jerusalem. Once a year, the Roman governor would come to town for a show of power when the people were gathering for Passover. There would be a big parade with horses, chariots, and soldiers. People were expected to shout and wave so the governor would think they were happy to see him. The problem was, the Romans had conquered this land and ruled without caring for the poorest people, for those with disabilities, the unemployed, women who had no husbands or children who had no parents. They were basically saying it was every person for themselves. But year after year, many people gathered, waved, and cheered so the Romans wouldn't make things worse for them. They felt they had no choice. But this particular year was different. This year, when the governor rode into town, there were not many people to welcome him. Something was happening on the other side of town. If you listen, you might be able to hear it. was riding into town on that day. He didn't have horses and chariots. He was riding on a donkey. And instead of soldiers marching to show the government's power, children and ordinary people were dancing around this man. On this side of town, Jesus was entering Jerusalem. People were so excited that they ran into the streets and took branches off of the trees to wave. They even laid down their cloaks for the donkey to walk on. They had heard that Jesus was reminding people that they were beloved children of God and teaching that they should love and care for each other. They were filled with hope that he would bring changes that would improve their lives. They shouted, Hosanna! which means, save us, we pray, and blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Oh, I can almost see and hear them now. celebrated. The people that day didn't know what would happen next or that on the other side of town powerful people were not happy with the way the crowds flocked to Jesus and took his teachings to heart. But Jesus knew the risks and he came into Jerusalem anyway. Let us pray. Loving God of hope, thank you for Jesus, who was brave enough to share your message of loving and caring for one another, 
no matter what the people in power thought. Please help us to be brave enough to love and care for one another, even though sometimes the world says it's better to just look out for ourselves. Amen. I'll see you next time. Bye.